Hey guys, Sam here from Technologetic and today I'm going to be showing you how to install Philips Hue in your home and how I use the connected light system of Philips Hue to automate the house. So let's have a look. So you just get your, um, obviously where you want to put it, just take out the uh, whatever light you had previously. that now out of the way get your other one get your Philips Hue bowl and make sure you get the right fitting type this isn't a screw light it's a bayonet so bayonet or if it's a Edison screw or they even do GU10 um, ones for like down lights put it in and uh, and that's it so like I just did just get uh, take out your previous light and put in your new Philips Hue. All right, and once you've got your new bulbs installed, just click on the light switch. Okay, and then I also got the uh, light dimmer kit. So I've got these little dimmers that I'm gonna put around the house so you can actually control the lights without having to have your phone or Siri on you. So they're just sticky tabs. So just peel these sticky tabs off. There's one, and the other one. Find the exact position that you wanna put it. Make sure it's level with the other one. And push it firmly to the wall for about 10 seconds. And that's it, it's attached. Okay, so to set up the lights, go into the Philips Hue app, go to light setup, hit the plus, and make sure your lights are actually on. I've already turned on both the lights that I just set up, so it should just be able to search for them. So, um, now to pair your dimmer switch, just go into settings, accessory setup, do the plus, view dimmer switch. Uh, we've never connected it to lights before, so we choose option one. And you've got to do this orange light flashing to do the setup. So you just hold it in your hand, get a little pin or something, and press this little setup button just here. You can see the uh, orange light's now blinking. So now it's searching for a switch. Okay, so it's successfully connected. Now you can just choose where you want to use it. So obviously I've only got one room. So uh, I'll just choose bedroom. Okay, done. And now my demo works for that, for that room. Okay, so now that I've set up my lights and the dimmer switch, I can go ahead and add a room. Um, so I'm gonna call this one the outside, basically. Just this one light. Room type, it is a, uh, I guess you call it a front door. Choose the outside light, what lights to put into it. I don't wanna add the default scenes. Let me just go save. And my other one I wanna do is the toilet, which is also one light. Room type, it's a uh, bathroom. And add the toilet light into that, save it. Now we've got our room set up. So we can go ahead and go into the accessories, choose that switch that I just had, and we can choose that to actually control the outside, which is what I want it to do, not the bedroom. And then you can go ahead and choose what each of the presses do, so you can set up different scenes for different bright, uh, light presses. So I'm gonna have it on bright is one of them. And maybe dimmed as the other, and then that's it. And save. So also in my house, I've got my bedroom set up. I've got four hue lights in the roof, and then I've got a strip behind the monitors. Um, basically, I use that um, so I can have the lights turn on when I say, hey Siri, turn the lights on. Um, and I can also have them controlled by via the app. or via HomeKit in iOS. So it's just here. 
and you can see all the different lights you've got and then you can see the rooms and you can set scenes and things for your different um, places. So this is really handy and enables me to also set up things like when I come home to have the lights automatically turn on and um, set them on timers and things like that. So thanks for watching this video on how I use Philips Hue in my house. If you found this video interesting, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Technologetic. And you can also follow us throughout the week on Instagram at Technologetic. Thanks for watching.